this person that gets everything done very often has an inability to say no because they're a people pleaser. They're career oriented. They don't want to say no to people. They, you know, they, they want to be the, that gives them a dopamine hit to be that go-to person, solve problems, get things done for people. But it comes at a huge personal cost. See Sweet and Sour, powered by Align, the podcast where we talk about the sweet and not so sweet sides of leadership. We have to have the ability, be given the right and respect to say no. Bosses are notorious. I was one of them, maybe, for giving my best people more and more duties, responsibilities, projects, things to do, because I knew they were going to get it done. And guess what? They already had their own projects. I'm piling more on. Maybe other people are piling projects on there. The boss never knows how they don't have a, a view of how full that plate is. And this person that gets everything done very often has an inability to say no because they're a people pleaser. They're career oriented. They don't want to say no to people. They, you know, they, they want to be the, that gives them a dopamine hit to be that go-to person, solve problems, get things done for people. But it comes at a huge personal cost because they get frustrated, get stressed out, they get overwhelmed. You know, they, they end up talking to their coach in, in tears because I just can't get everything done. And I've, I've had many, many of those conversations. So it's the ability and the right within a culture of an organization to be able to say no, especially to the boss. 